Tonight, Fairfax County police are investigating whether a teenage boy stabbed his mother's boyfriend to protect her during an attack. The man died from his injuries. Officers responded to the Creekside Village apartments in the Hybla Valley area just before 10 last night. Northern Virginia Bureau Chief Julie Carey spoke with a neighbor about what he heard before police were called. Police dispatch audio shows it was the teen himself who called 911 from inside his family's apartment to report the stabbing. The caller said he stabbed his mom's boyfriend in the neck. It happened around 10 p.m. in a second floor apartment inside this building at the Creekside Village Complex. Stephen Proctor was in the neighboring apartment. He says a mother and her five kids have lived next door for years that the woman's boyfriend comes to visit on weekends. But last night, an unusual commotion next door. Um, I heard a bunch of fussing, a lot of rumbling, because their uh, three bedroom, their back bedroom is close to our closet. The little girl said, stop choking my mama. And that's when it got quiet. That's when the cops showed up. First responders found the boyfriend with a life-threatening stab wound. We have the suspect in custody. Medics are on scene now. We're rendering aid. The stabbing victim was rushed to the hospital where he died. The teen boy initially taken into custody, telling police he stabbed the man to protect his mother. Stephen Proctor says it fits with what he's observed. From seeing them by, you know, being in the neighborhood, he was very protective of his mother. If you saw him, you saw her because she's not, she wasn't married. But he was very protective of his mother. I hope he gets justice because evidently he's just doing right what he felt, protecting his mother. Another neighbor who didn't want to go on camera described the teenage boy as very friendly. She said he always opened the door for her and sometimes even carried groceries up to her third floor apartment. Police say after questioning, the teen was released to the custody of his mother. They confirmed detectives are looking into the possibility that this is a case of justifiable homicide. In Fairfax County, I'm Julie Carey, News 4. The mother was treated there on the scene for her injuries. The man who was killed has been identified as Marcus Roberson from the District of Columbia.